Dr. Freeman, you made it. Hey! Boy, are we glad to be here. Yeah, we heard you ran into a little trouble out there. The Combine's been trying to hit in the front door. <laughs> I think they learned their lesson. You mind if we uh, keep dog patrolling out here? <laughs> Not at all. You heard him, dog. I'm gonna go see Dad. I'll catch up to you later. You take care of yourself. I don't think Eli knows you're here yet. He's in Silo 1 access unit, right through here. Shall we? You smell that? I don't feel anything anymore. <laughs> you you talk to me? What now? This oh is... no, what's that? Well, now what? All right, best to work, everyone. It's just another false alarm in the secondary silo. Let's take a walk. Same old Dr. Magnuson. So, have you ever used an AR-2 before? AR-2? No. Now, nah, an AR-3, sure. Plenty of times. There is no such thing as an AR-3. Well, see, in the city, the place was lousy with AR-3s. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. No, it was. So, do you know what the alternative fire method does on the AR-2? It kills hunters. How did you city folk kill hunters? We sure as hell didn't use guns. We would just wrestle hunters to the ground with our bare hands. I used to kill 10, 20 a day, just using my fists. Oh, so when you're out in the field, you're gonna be punching hunters? In the field? I'm not going out in the field. I'm a radio operator. <sighs> That's it. Leave. You don't need to be here, and I'm not gonna continue the lesson until you leave. I'm staying right here. I am serious. Leave. Not going to continue until you leave. Hey, Gordon, man, you made it. Dad! Alex! I was so afraid I wouldn't see you again. There, there, sweetheart. We're together now. That's all that matters. And look at you, son. <laughs> I knew if you both stayed together, you could get through anything. Yeah? We make a pretty good team. <laughs> yeah, well, that's good, because, well, now that the suppression feels down, we all have to do our part. Dad! Can you blame an old man for warning grandkids? <laughs> <laughs> What's... what happened to you? Dad, it's not what it looks like. I'm fine. Are you sure? Shouldn't we have that looked at? Really? I'm fine. Uh, where's Dr. Kleiner? We should get this data to him right away. Uh, okay. Yes. Yes, we should. He'll be glad for a chance to get out of the silo. This way, Gordon. Hey! I was watching that. Well, he and Magnuson have been going at it. You think they were still competing for grant money? <laughs> <laughs> Something's never changed. <laughs> Do we have any idea how long until the Super Portal's active? We don't know for certain. We're keeping an eye on it. And what about the Combine? Will we be able to launch before they attack? It's gonna be close. All it would take is one Strider to destroy our rocket. But we're ready for him. I'm sorry we couldn't get here any sooner, Dad. Don't worry, sweetheart. We're gonna make it. I'm just so glad to have you back. <sighs> I'm glad to be back. Not to mention a delight to see you here at last. And Gordon, I see you in the HEV suit have taken excellent care of each other. <laughs> They're inseparable. The data, people, the data! 
Feiner, are you going to sync up the satellite, or should I postpone the launch to make time for a family reunion? All right, all right. All right. I was just saying hello to Alex and Gordon. Oh, fine. No one grants me a moment's peace, but by all means, unroll the red carpet. Good grief. I only meant they might... I know, I know. Oh, never mind him. Now, my dear, where is this data packet you've been carrying? If I delay a single moment, I'll never hear the end of it. You have my word on it. It's right here, Dr. Kleiner. We've got a ton of data. The strange thing is, it was all attached to a transmission from Judith. Transmission? From Judith? Do you mean the message didn't get through? We've got to see this right away. Just let me start the decoding process, and then we can view it in the auxiliary control room. For God's sake, hurry. Yes, yes, of course. Another alarm? Oh, what next in the parade of constant interruption? Hello? Hello? Is anyone there? Anyone? <sighs> Folks, alarms all day. Damn crows have been nesting in the tracks. I do not know how I am supposed to concentrate with all of this racket. Freeman. Freeman, you're not doing anything. Make yourself useful and find out what the hell is going on in there. Uh, yes. Gordon, if you don't mind, I'd feel better if you had a look. Catch up with us when you're done. Freeman! Doors will have sealed due to the alert, so you'll have to go through the bottom of the launch tube. I'll open this hatch to let you down. Now, once you're down there, I'll have Uriah let you into the secondary silo. Well, what are you waiting for, Freeman? A hug? The situation's not going to investigate itself. <laughs> Magnuson has instructed me to admit you into the secondary silo. The secondary silo can be reached through here. 